<clears throat> this particular um, trailer is for a movie called A Hidden Life. Um, sounds to me like it's like a drama type um, type story. It's got Terrence Malick in it, and I'm not picturing his face, so probably I know who he is, but I'll need to watch this to remind myself who he is. I think, um, well, I don't think I know that it has something to do with Nazis because in the thumbnail it showed a guy that looked like he was in a German um, Nazi or SS uniform and uh, there was a swastika somewhere in the picture. So let's check this out and see what it's about. Remember the day when we first met? I remember that motorcycle, my best dress. You looked at me and I knew how simple life was then. <laughs> Innocent people raiding other countries, preying on the weak. If our leaders, if they're evil, what does one do? You have a duty to the fatherland. The church tells you so. You cannot say no to your race and your hope. You are a traitor. I can't swear loyalty to Hitler. I can't. Do you think your defiance will change the course of things? Yeah, no! If God gives us free will, we're responsible for what we do, what we fail to do. I can't do what I believe is wrong. <laughs> we have to stand up to evil. Okay, so is that, so it was written and directed by him. Is that him? Is that actor Terrence Malick? I sort of recognized his face, but um, I couldn't tell you where I've seen him. This movie, I don't know why I had the idea that it was about maybe someone who had been in um, the SS or, you know, the Nazi army and, and who was, hiding his life like maybe after the war and he was hiding his his previous identity that's what I thought it was about but that's not what it's about obviously I have a terrible feeling that this is just going to end awfully for this guy and I um at well to be I, I I probably won't watch this film um I'll probably read uh I'll probably read up on the facts of this story or read a, a movie spoiler type thing. This just, it just looks like such a terribly depressing film and I just, I can't, it's, it's, I don't know, it's just awful. You know, you're watching it and there's nothing you can do. You can't do anything, you're just observing these awful events and you can't help the guy, you can't do anything. And I can only imagine what he must have felt like, this poor fella, um, I don't know how much of this, um, it says it was inspired by true events. I don't know how much of it is going to be dramatized for the movie. Obviously, that would be something that could be easily found out. I'm sure there will be articles written about it. It says it's coming out in December. Um, so I will, I will read up on this, but I currently have no plans to watch this particular movie. Or if I do, I just have to be in a certain frame of mind, which does not happen very often that I want to see something as depressing as this. So um, the trailer itself, it felt like 
it, it clocks in at about two minutes, nine seconds, two minutes, 10 seconds, around in there. So a little bit more than two, two minutes, but it did kind of feel like it was a little bit on the long side. Uh, some of the stuff that they showed, they probably, probably wasn't necessary. It was just repetitive, you know, sort of similar to stuff they had already shown. So that's really my only issue as far as this. It's not a huge one. It wasn't, um, I, I, I wasn't, kind of feeling like okay get on with it I just could sense that it was a bit on the longish side <clears throat> so um, but yeah I um, I'll return here and and maybe make a post or something after I've read up on the facts of this particular story so uh, and if anybody sees it let me know what you think about it because like I said I, I don't have plans to watch this at this at this juncture I have no plans to watch this so Okay, well, there's that one. I guess that's it, you guys. Bye.